Hello and welcome back to Boxing Social in association with Betfred. My name is Eamon Khan. I'm here in Wembley SSE Arena with the one and only Miss GB, Natasha Jonas, who is victorious on a ring return. Natasha, how's life treating you? Um, it's, it's okay. It's good. It's good now, anyway. I'm not complaining. For sure, for sure. I mean, uh, let's talk about you just getting back in the ring, getting out there. You must have had itchy knuckles for a long time. It's feel great to put those gloves back on and hit them against someone's face, essentially. <laughs> yeah, it's just, you know, it's all the little things that you forget in the gym and there's things that you can't replicate. You know, fight days, a whole lot different for being in the gym. Um, and I'm just glad to, to be out, to get that off, have a good Christmas, have a break. I've been training since June, waiting on dates that haven't come. So now that I've got the date, I'm happy that it's done. I'll have a good Christmas with my little girl and then we'll hit the ground running next year. You mentioned, I think I heard ringside after your performance, you felt that little bit of ring rust in there um, in terms of you, know, you getting back to how your kind of normal best. What was it you kind of feeling that wasn't quite clicking in the initial stages there? I think, you know, unfortunately for me, it's not, it's quite well known that I have a slow start anyway <laughs> and I get better as the rounds go on. But I was, that was something I've been trying to work on, but I just, I just didn't feel it in a rhythm until about round three. I was wondering, um, you know, you've, you've moved now to boxer. You've got that kind of backing and that push that you kind of wanted to kind of get that kind of push promotion for you to kind of push forward and get a title fight. So how important is it for you to have that faith behind you for you to kind of achieve your goals in the sport as well with that boxer had given you? Nothing in the world is possible without you believing in yourself and believing that you can. Whether that, you know, you see it, you hear it, you smell it, you taste it, you touch it, whatever that is, and unless you have that, it's, it's not going to happen. Um, your, your, your mind is more um, is, is more influential than your body in some cases, and uh, um, yeah. In the time that you've been out, you've seen uh, obviously the other women have been out, and the divisions have kind of fluctuated, they've, they've changed. Boxing's ever moving, of course. How quickly do you want to get back into kind of the title contention and be contesting for those world honours? Yeah, I think that, I think there's I've got to get myself into mandatory position, and and then you know, progress from there and get challenged for the titles from there. But I'm not under no illusion that I'm just going to jump into to titles straight away. I'm going to put myself in the relevant place that I need to be to, to do that. It wasn't Liverpool this time round, it was London. Uh, could have been Liverpool if things had been a little bit different. But do you want to get that kind of homecoming return back, return fight? Uh, you know, obviously as the fans have come back as well. Yeah, uh, this, uh, tonight was the first time in two years that I fought in, in front of a crowd, which sounds crazy. Um, but it is, and yeah, I, I mean, I think every boxer dreams of, you know, fighting in the Vegas is fighting in Madison Square Garden, but genuinely there's no place like home. Um, you know, you look at the, the Liam Smith fight with Fala, and you, you see the reception that he got his walkout. I got goose pimples, so I only know what he felt, felt like. Um, and to have that in front of your home crowds is massive. Do you look at kind of, obviously you had that fight with Terry Harper, very close fight, a lot of people had you winning that fight. Terry Harper's now since been dethroned by Alicia Baumgartner. Do you look at maybe wanting that rematch with Terry? Do you want to look at Alicia? What's your kind of plot forward? Um, I've seen a few things on, social, on the socials, as you do. You know, a few comments, a few statements. And um, generally, I, if I'm honest, she hasn't got anything that I want anymore. And that's, I mean, and Terry. Um, Potentially, if that's the only fight there, that I'd take it. Or maybe I would put it on a three, a free fight weight like I did, <laughs> like she made me do. Um, but yeah, gen generally, there's, there's like anyone, wherever I can get it, whoever, you know, me and the team um, target, that's where I'll go. Actually, you've got the victory now. I just want to know how Miss GB celebrates the victory. By going to work on Sky. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for keeping waiting. Thank you so much for picking Box and Social. Congratulations on the win. Thank you so much.